Hi, I'm Mike Duffy and here are your headlines from 7 Action News. The Detroit Animal Care Center is in need of help following a dryer fire. City leaders tell us no animals were hurt in that fire. They're looking for other local rescues and shelters to take nearly 180 animals as they work to clean up the center and clear out all that smoke. Any rescue able to help should contact the center. Police in Ann Arbor need your help catching an accused bank robber. Take a look. Police say this man walked into the Chase Bank on Stadium Boulevard this morning. He demanded money from the teller, implying he was armed. He left in a silver model sedan with an undisclosed amount of money. If you recognize him or have any information, call Ann Arbor Police. Also in Ann Arbor, more than 3,000 University of Michigan nurses picketing today as they're fighting for patient care and a fair contract. Nurses say there's a staffing shortage that's putting patients at risk. They've also been working without a contract since the beginning of July. Union leaders tell us this picket, this is not a strike. Those participating are off duty. The university releasing a statement regarding the picket. It reads in part, because we deeply value our nurses, we've put together a generous package that recognizes the value they bring to our patients and our organization. Here's meteorologist Mike Taylor now with a check of your seven first alert forecast. Mike. Looking at our forecast for tonight, thinking we'll have some spotty showers and temperatures will be into the mid 60s. But for Sunday, some of that rain could be heavy at times, could lead to some localized flooding. And then the heat returns for Tuesday with a high of 90.